Hey everyone. So this is a video that I've kind of been wanting to make for a while now. It's something that's been on my mind for the past couple of years. But what makes this such a good time to make it is the fact that the word simp has uh, become a part of the daily vernacular of retards on Twitter. So it just kind of makes the uh, perfect environment to make a video like this. So there's this particular uh, clip of a uh, Twitch thought uh, just, just begging for uh, likes, subs, donations. All, all that fun stuff. Basically, she's just complaining that she's not getting enough donations and subscriptions and stuff on her stream. It's actually really sad. I'll, I'll show you the clip here. It, it's it's pretty hilarious. It doesn't really matter how much money you make or how much money you have. That's really the thing. Because I'm not asking you for a large financial contribution. If it costs $20 to sub, $20 is quite a bit of money. $20 is you can get a full meal for $20. And the difference of $20 and eating a meal is in that $20. Like, that's where it is. But a sub is $5. At maximum, in whatever your currency is, it's maybe $10. And it doesn't matter how broke you are, if you have time to watch Twitch, you have you have $10, truly. If you don't have $10, you probably don't have time to watch Twitch because you should be working, you should be trying to earn money. Uh, it's not a ton, it's not like a ton of money. So being like, I'm broke, I can't afford to sub, it, that doesn't really track. What you mean to say is, I'm so irresponsible with my money, I can't support the entertainment that I enjoy. <laughs> That's what that is. Man. Man. So yeah, uh, she's she's taken lessons from the school of Wings of Redemption, where you complain that you're not getting enough attention on your videos despite having a large view count. So my issue with uh, the, these these thoughts, these absolute hoes, oh. it's just how like absolute scum and and just how greedy these people are. How greedy can you be to have thousands of viewers on your stream and then complain that you're not earning enough money? First off. If she's getting thousands of viewers like this on her stream, you know that the massive crowd of simps are just immediately donating to her stream. Uh, oh, here, here's 20 bucks. Um, please, please say my name on stream. These people who manipulate just these absolute, just lonely ass people into donating to them are the same people who complain that they're not making enough money on stream. It's not really difficult to see the issue that people have. These streamers aren't really doing anything actually productive. It's basically just softcore porn, but there's no nudity because, uh, Twitch doesn't like that. So it just makes absolutely no sense that these Twitch thoughts who have to do absolutely nothing but just sit there for hours on stream and just let the retard army pull their money in donations and these people are just complaining that they're not making any money and that they're not getting enough donations and subscriptions. These people are lucky to be making money, all right? I don't think I need to remind you all the fact that a lot of people right now are out of a job or are laid off and aren't making anything because they're not working any hours. So these people should be lucky that they're even getting donations at all because a lot of people aren't working and aren't doing anything to make money because they, they can't, They're, they don't have work. So these people are like, oh, well, why aren't you donating and subscribing more? It's cause no one has any money, you retards. This lady isn't the only one who's uh, displayed such moronic behavior. I think a lot of other Twitch streamers in general have uh, have done this, mostly uh, Twitch thoughts in the just chatting section. But uh, you know, that that's just my personal observations. It's absolutely sad how entitled these people are to other people's money. That is probably the last bit of money they have. I'm not saying that these simps are stupid for doing that, right? I'm, I'm gonna get into that later. But it is absolutely moronic that these people are begging for more donations and subscriptions while also being so incredibly socially unaware to the problems that a lot of people are having right now where they're just, they, they don't have any way to make money. So that covers mostly the uh, the Twitch thoughts, right? But I don't think you can really talk about the thoughts of Twitch or the sheer number of simps, absolute simps. It's incredible how many of these people there are. People have built their entire Twitch and YouTube careers off of these lonely guys who have absolutely nothing to do but to donate money to random people. I don't understand the mentality with these people. Like they think donating $20 to their favorite streamer or YouTuber is gonna, gonna make them like su suck their dick or something. Like I, I really don't understand the logic here. We wouldn't have this problem of Twitch thoughts and just e-girls in general ruining the YouTube and Twitch landscape if it wasn't for these absolute retards enabling these people by giving them more money. It's supply and demand. If the demand goes down, the supply also goes down. It's very, it's it's simple thoughtonomics. These Twitch thoughts and e-girls are smarter than most people think. They act intentionally stupid and ignorant to draw lonely men to them in hopes that they can manipulate them into whatever they want. When in reality, it's these people who are just stringing along these lonely guys uh, to get more donations and subs and it's actually it's it's kind of genius I'm not gonna lie if I wasn't like a 3 out of 10 on a good day I might actually try it myself so in conclusion these twitch and YouTube thoughts and just these e-girls in general 
we wouldn't have them if it wasn't for the simp culture that they have around these channels where you just have these like lonely guys just donating these women money in hopes that like they'll sleep with them or something it makes absolutely no sense people will complain about the twitch thoughts and the e-girls and stuff ruining the landscape and while i think that's partially true they're simply meeting a demand in the dumbass anomic scale if it wasn't for these retarded simps enabling this kind of behavior we wouldn't really have this problem and i think it would make the youtube and twitch uh, ecosystems a much better place because i think what we need to emphasize is the fact that these people aren't doing it for enjoyment they aren't doing it to make good content they're just doing it to make money if you have more people in these videos video creation platforms who are just doing it to make money, that's simply just going to attract more people who think that they can also do the same thing. It heavily dilutes the community and just makes it into people who are making content simply for the sake of making money and not actually caring about their craft. The people who are actually caring about their craft on YouTube and Twitch are becoming fewer and far between because you got thoughts like this saying that, oh yeah, you know, we could just do this and make money. But at the same time, uh, you know, these simps are also equally to blame. In fact, I would say that these simps play a greater role in the stottery going around. So, uh, yeah, simp bad, thought bad, uh, magic bacon TV good. Thank you. So anyway, guys, those are my thoughts on the whole situation uh, with this, like, simp and e-girl thought drama we've had over the past week or two. We've kind of seen it ever since the whole iDubs drama, but I'm still kind of surprised it's continued. So, guys, those are my thoughts on the whole Twitch e-girl situation we've had over the past couple days. But anyway, if you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like down below, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.